what is your favorite meal? Put it down below there because one day I'm a mash for you. Thank you again guys for all your guys suggestion we'll throw the old one on top you gotta do it carefully now guys there you go here it goes let's get into this guys another Sunday we're making this one in this pile here got one This Sunday, we're making typical German currywurst from Agent Herbu Mitsnit Mitsnitzel Mits Mit Schnitzel. Turn the jump in. Yo guys, let's get into this. Any yeast oil recipe will work. I've thrown it to the side just for it to prove as a way I braise a ham hock, one tablespoon of olive oil, one tablespoon of minced garlic, chop onions, and two tablespoon of Worcester. As the onions brown, light season salt and pepper, and dash of smoked paprika on the ham hock. Uh, when the onions caramelize, I've added in the ham hock, fall in with two cups of beef broth, let that simmer on a medium for the time being, and when the dough double in size, I cut it into eight ounce balls, rolled it out into 20 inch in length, and found whipping and pulling the dough as you roll helped a lot with getting it into the 20 inch length and later twist it into pretzel dough form shape and letting it proof once more then bowl into boiling water with uh, one tablespoon of baking soda for two minutes on each side a light coat of egg wash and coarse salt on top and into the oven for 15 minutes at 375 Snitzel, I had the whole table covered in newspaper because of the meat splatter that was going to happen. The beating of the meat is just one way to tenderize the meat. I had an extra piece of tenderloin and decided to make spatzel, a German dumpling dish into a saucepan, one tablespoon of olive oil, minced garlic, half a cup of onions, one pound of pork tenderloin, one tablespoon of smoked paprika, salt, pepper, one cup of uh, chopped mushroom, and two cups of ham hock juice. Spatzel, 500 grams of flour, 250 ml of water, four eggs, one tablespoon of salt. i seen online traditionally spatzel is cooked like this and decided to do it how the Germans do it. Cooked it until float uh, to the surface and into cold water to stop the cooking process. Last minute things, light coat of salt and pepper into the flour, then into egg wash, then to the breadcrumbs, and then into hot oil for 10 minutes. Yo! Let's get into this guys. Before we even start guys, let's get this out of the way. Holsten Premium. It's a German beer. There you are. Most of you guys are gonna hate me for this. But I'm pretty good at pouring beer. Pause. I had to Google that. <laughs>
Alright guys, let's get into this. German bees. <laughs> Quick time. This is what we got. Uh, spatzel. It's uh, German dumplings with uh, pork gravy. Pork, some sort of pork meat gravy on top and mushroom. Uh, pickles. Sauerkraut. Uh, currywurst. Uh, what is this? Red cabbage. Homemade pretzel. And schnitzel. Let's get into this. What do you guys want to try first? A busted up schnitzel right here, guys. Take the first bite, guys. <laughs> you guys got it? Nice. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. -mm. So good. Mm. <clears throat> mm -mm. Mm. Mm. Forgot the lime or lemon. I done goofed. Let's do it again, guys. Take the first bite, guys. Has lemon on it now. You guys got it? Is it focusing? Nice. Mm. So bomb for me. Mm. Mm. Everything just works perfectly with the beer. No more beer. It sucks. Mm. 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 Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Germans are eating so good.
Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm laughing. <laughs> Bombs! I don't know what it is, guys. But hands down, best food to have when you're drinking. No joke. <laughs> so bombs. I was having an adventure in my own mind. <laughs> so bombs. This is what I'm picking up, guys. <laughs> you guys see it? Some of you guys think I'm picking up invisible things. I'm not. question guys what do Germans do after that that's a lot of beers I know you Germans are laughing at me right now but hope you guys enjoy this. <laughs> don't forget to subscribe if you haven't also put down your favorite meal because one Sunday I'm a master for you <laughs>